hello everyone and welcome to the channel my name is adam this is hmo4 gaming and this is persona 5 royal and you're probably wondering if you're a veteran on this channel persona 5 royal adam you already had a playthrough well it is the day after persona 5 royal came to all modern platforms and yes that includes the nintendo switch and that is what we're going to be having this brand new spanking new super revamp and revitalized playthrough on just wanted to show it off as you see on my channel has a lot of switch games and what better way to enjoy one of my favorite games of all time than right here on the switch and if you're excited for that please hit like hit subscribe do all those things on down below let's start the party this story is a work of fiction Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. I agree. The contract has been sealed. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion and ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. Beginning of the game still, you know, throws you off because it's like, what? Where the hell are we at? It just puts you, like, almost to the end game point to start. And then we go all the way back to the past to see what happened. So far, the Switch version looks the same. You know, I did test it last night just to see how everything was. Um, yeah, no, it's not that bad. Obviously, the cutscenes are as they were. They're not any different. They're not any crappier or anything like that. Um, the gameplay itself was totally fine. Um, maybe you can notice little bits. It could be like maybe a shade a little buzzier, but nothing too crazy. And with this playthrough, you know, I just wanted to revamp it. My original one wasn't wasn't the greatest and now that I have a foothold on how all this YouTube stuff is supposed to go and how it's supposed to be presented you know I just wanted it to be a little bit better especially with those first few episodes of that persona series maybe I'll link it down below if you want to look at the cringe um, wasn't that great Good. Now get running. was it wasn't exactly uh, you know very this is our only well chance. let's just say I didn't have any stage presence if uh, for this uh, game in particular. You can get away now. We'll retrieve the briefcase on our end. Is that what he said? What was that? Don't worry about us. Just concentrate on getting away. And as you can see, as we're going through the casino here, nothing too crazy. And yeah, this is the first time I'm actually playing on the dock. Handheld mode looks just as good. Like I said, I don't know the specifics. I'm not Digital Foundry. I'm sure they're going to be taking a look at all versions eventually, I would imagine. But at least for this, on dock, it looks just as good as the PlayStation 4 version. The dock, ver the handheld version looks just fine. <laughs> really impressed. Gets into our first battle of the game. Against the Minotaur. I forget what his name is, but I know he eats children. <laughs> uh, at least that's the lore that's in Persona era SMT5, is that he eats children and whatnot. Oh, look at that crit right off the bat. I'm pretty sure that's probably Sage, but you know. Oh, we are not gonna get hit? Go down. Look at that, we didn't get hit. Well, we used our HP, but we didn't get physically hit. Good. You defeated them with ease. 
if you watch some of those runs where Persona 5 Royal, no hit. Some people sit on that fight for a long time trying to not get hit on that. And I just did it nonchalantly. It's a good, it's a blessing on our run right here. Alright, see you later, bros. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. <laughs> you should be able to get out that way. Hurry! Dude, can you even hear us? Don't worry. I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker! Hmm? Wait a sec. I'm getting a weird reading heading your way. Come on, run! Listen, boy's voice. He, I can hear you just fine. It's just I'm really quiet. Leave me alone. And you're probably wondering what all these uh, signs mean. Success, winner take all, everyone's an enemy. Uh, we'll check on all that in about 60 hours. <laughs> Ish. Now, already having context of all this, it's kind of interesting that just these random cops are just running around huh? this place. What? This is bad, Joker. Hi. You'll never get away if you just keep fighting. Hide in the shadows and sneak past when you see an opening. No, I will not do that. Are you sure you came in this way? Understood, I'll come to Cindy to search. I don't get paid enough for this. Now's your chance, make a run for it. Alright, let's go. And here's a new mechanic of the game. Uh, how many ten, How many are there? Everything okay? The security level may be high, but not too much. Oh, I thought that was a security guard. Eh, close enough. <laughs> I know, I know, I'm looking for another route. Just hang on. Oh, perfect timing, Joker. Look up. New mechanic of Persona 5 Royal. You can use that thing and fly over there. And if you're not, I'm not kidding about the Switch version, we're pressing L this time instead of R1. Crazy. And let's get out of here get to one of the first epic moments of Persona 5 Royal. Joker, stop! What? What? What happened? It's an enemy right near you. Oh, you guys instant transmission in. This cutscene is just magnifique. I'll end this right now. Joker, it's her! She's the weird reading I've been getting! Get him. Get him, Violet. It also killed me that she wasn't in Strikers. Why they made a sequel to Persona 5 and not Persona 5 Royal is just beyond me. My weak self relied on you so much. That ends today. Or they could have like added Kasumi as like some kind of DLC, but whatever. Let's do this, Senpai. All right, getting into our second battle of the game. It is still. Definitely script it, but you know, it's got some flair to get you into the game itself. It looks like Boyish Voice knows who that is. It's been a while since we last fought side by side. But this time, it's my turn to come to your aid, Senpai. And I'm not really too sure. Oh no, it won't let me. Okay. Because I want to directly command everybody. I ain't all about, you know, them acting freely. You can have the original, like, a game like Persona 3 experience by letting your party members just do whatever. But, no. Same thing with Persona 4. Direct controls are essential. Um, and Persona 3 Portable. They added that to that in a later re-release, so definitely props for that. And just makes the game so much better than trying to rely on brain-dead AI. Well, for this, we're just gonna... Uh, I don't remember if he, they're actually weak to curse damage. I would imagine they wouldn't put, like, weak, so we're gonna try it. Nah. But she's just gonna kill everybody. 
Yeah. <laughs> Script it crit. And we get to see her all out attack. And that'll be the last time we see that for quite some time. I think that's the last of them. Okay, mystery girl. I genuinely have no clue what just happened, but I take it you're okay? Wait, bad news. Enemy backups headed your way. You need to book it right now. Please go. I'm going to make it harder for them to track you down. You still okay. have something you need to do as a phantom thief, right? Yes, I need to finish the rest of the game. The base then game, I anyway. I won't stop you. Since I'm not a member of the Phantom Thieves, I'm in no position to interfere. You can interfere whatever you want there, Violet. You can do whatever. However, please don't forget the promise we made, okay? Yeah, it's been a while since I actually got that Joker, far into this game. I think her name's go, Violet, go, go. her code name. If not, I'm just really dumb. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Go up the stairs at the end of the path. Just a little more, so hang in there. All right, let's go get caught by the police, as you do. And into Juvie we go. <laughs> it's still a damn good way to start the game, thinking you're just gonna get arrested, and that's the end of the game. To find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. Surprise, surprise. The life of a thief. Suspect confirmed. Cuff it. Shouldn't do any hard drugs. Oh wait. Yes, the drug was too strong. I'm being interrogated. Wake him up. No dozing off. You guys are not making a good example of the Japanese justice you system. Still don't get it. Do Beating you? up on a high school kid. Give it up. Come on, cooperate. What? You want another shot? You know what the funny thing is? Like, in the context of this, I haven't really done anything uh, wrong. What about the and this dude is, like, treating me like I'm, Are like, a mass murderer. It can be used as video evidence? Well, mass murderer, maybe, but. I'm gonna remain quiet, because I'm badass. You hear my question? Answer! <coughs> Obstruction of justice. Blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And 
You seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? All right, and for this playthrough, as the thumbnail suggests, we are doing this on hard mode. Which, Persona 5 Royal after a while, it's a little difficult in the beginning, but as we go along in the game, we get access to a variety of things, which makes it really not that hard in the end. You forget you're playing on hard, actually. Merciless, well, you that's kind of a little, uh, you know, something for those vets that want some kind of crazy challenge. It's not so much hard. Again, it's it's just like all the other difficulties. Once you get to a certain point in the game, it's kind of trivial once you know how everything works. Sign here. But if you get killed it's or hit in a battle with a weakness or something, uh, get this out of my face. I see. I need your hand to sign this, but I don't care if you end up losing a leg. This guy's nuts trying to kill me. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. Uh, I'm we not gonna going to listen to you, generic you police officer. One must take full responsibility for their actions. Man, what's my name again? God, I can't even... I can't even think. Uh... I got the Adam part right. Uh, but what was the rest? Uh, I think uh, strength? But I'm not really too sure how you spell that. My head's kind of fuzzy, so... I remember in my old Pokemon, the HMO4 was for strength, so... We're gonna go with that. Yeah, that sounds right. Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... Are you prosecutor Sai Nijima? I just got off the phone with your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. I thought I ordered you to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed in interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much though. Ah, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. His methods are unknown, after all. We don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. Oh, hello, Ms. Lady. What can I do for you? I didn't expect it'd be you. Yeah, it's me. You'll be answering my questions this time. Okay. Yeah, they they said it would me? help me uh it seems my you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here. Shots. And I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. Uh, what do you want to know? This isn't an issue of whether or not it can be used in court. I need to know. This is my case, after all. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Start from the very beginning. All right, I gotta go 70-ish hours, possibly into the past. Let's do it. Oh, see, 
Those vitamin K shots are making me see shit. Damn. You are held captive. A prisoner of fate to a future that has been sealed in advance. This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. I beg you, please overcome this game and save the world. The key to victory lies within the memories of your bonds, the truth that you and your friends grasped. It all began that day, when the game was started half a year ago. For the sake of your world's future, as well as your own, you must remember. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for riding with us today. We will be arriving in Shibuya shortly. This is the last stop for this line. This reminds me of I'm really looking forward to see if the PS Vita kit is still the PS Vita kit even on the Switch. <laughs> Subplot. <laughs> it's gotta be a joke. You really love all that occult stuff, don't you? <laughs> it wouldn't be an SMT game without the occult stuff. And if you're familiar with this game, this was kind of like the initial teaser trailer that came out way back. I think in like 2014, 2015. This little cutscene right here was like the first uh, uh, trailer that showed off. And then it showed the red chairs with the chains. Uh, my phone is broken. Damn T-Mobile. I need to get an upgrade. I'm acting like I've never seen a flash mob before. <laughs> Man, these guys over here in the square going all out with this flash mob. <laughs> Worst flash mob ever. And now I have this freaking virus on my phone. Damn. Alright. We've arrived here finally. And Yogan Jaya, you're on the Switch. Getting into some tutorials and some hints. The tutorials are rather intrusive. We're going to be going through a lot of them. So bear with there. we got to set up the game. If you're ever confused about where to do or where to go, uh, please just look up in the upper right corner of the screen to view the hints. Right now we had head to your new lodging and exit the subway station. Alright. No one's ever talking responsibility, it's a waste of time to dwell on it. Dang right, overhearing person. And here we go, Yoken Jaya. And I like some of the updated versions. We have, uh, characters we might be seeing in future. That might have been one right there that isn't a faceless nobody. Starting today, Sojiro Sakura will be taking care of me. His house should be in the back streets of this residential area. But where? I don't know. Rotating the camera? If you use the R, you'll be able to rotate the camera. If you press B or click on R, you can bring the camera back to its default position. You can adjust the speed and direction of the camera rotation and configurations and rotate the camera to look around the city at the people looking near you. Talking to people! Oh no, we have to talk to people in this game. 
All sorts of people live in the city, try listening to their conversations, or press an A to talk to them, might just learn something. Damn, I have to talk to somebody. Hello, police officer, can you tell me where to go? Oh no, he's unfriendly. What? What is it? I want directions. Uh, you want to get the residence of that address? It's an alley a bit further back. Take a ride after that apartment with the stairs. Oh, see, he wasn't that unfriendly. Oh no, you look like somebody from a previous game. Ah, oh, what do I do? I'm feeling under the weather, but I've got an important meeting tomorrow. I thought I'd get this place a shot, but they said they were closed for the day. And it's still early too, I just can't believe it. Maybe I should go in and ask again. Oh, the meds? Oh, look at this nice little clinic. Cool. This place looks like it's a clinic, but I don't think Sojiro Sakura is a doctor. <laughs> I didn't even know that was a text for that. For that. Not there. Hello, these people look like they're talking about something. Hello. Oh, I'm just eavesdropping. Was there another, uh, a attack resident? I see a policeman over there. Oh, he's just watching to make sure everyone's safe. He'd be scary if something like that happened again. Though, let's hurry home. Okay. And if we got here, alley on the, the last alley on the right, we get to Sojura Sakura's house. The nameplate here says Sakura. It looks like this might be Sojura Sakura's house. Da da da. <laughs> Wouldn't you know? Hello, anybody home? Even after ringing the doorbell, it doesn't look like anyone will answer the door. Maybe he's gone. Looks like no one's home. What? Oh yeah, Sakura-san's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, it belongs in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Hmm. Next, I need to take this package to... Was that at it? That might have been new dialogue. I don't remember the delivery man talking. Or having, like, his own dialogue. Huh. I mean, any veterans who played this game multiple times out there, is was that new or am I just, like, huh? Did we add voice lines to a game art that's, like, super, well, I mean, it's not super old, but, man, they put an effort to put some dialogue to some people? Interesting. Also, this is LeBlanc. <laughs> it looks like this place is LeBlanc. Go inside. Yeah, there's really nothing else to see. transit bus was driven down an opposing lane with its customers still in it. The citizens can't live in peace if this keeps up. Oh, how frightening. What could be going on? Didn't something similar happen just the other day? And down is uh, the name of a shellfish used in pearl farming. Hello, Matt. Pink uh, oh, shirt it, man. Right. I'm very good at crossword puzzles, too. I love doing them every today. other week. Oh, we'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. A what now? There's been a string of those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. It's none of my concern. We'll see you next time. Hello, Mr. Manager guy. I don't think they paid. I don't see any money on the table. Uh, four hours for just a single cup of joe. Yeah, well. So, you're the guy. I'm that guy. Please take care of me. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. You're the one, huh? I'm that Have one. Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other. And, cool. Uh, not that that matters. Follow me. Oh, where are we going? Oh, he's put me in an attic. This <laughs> is your room. What? I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. Oh, well, at least there's that. Hmm? You look like you want to say something. It's kind of cluttered. I don't like clutter. It's on you to clean up the rest. Oh, okay. Well, what do I do with all this I lock crap? up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. All right. You don't have to play now, so hardball with me, then. We just I met. I got the gist of your situation. 
You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her. He got injured, then sued you, right? That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? I mean, that was now pretty, that uh, record, you were pretty crazy to kind of help out someone get sexually harassed, but all right. Here, which your parents also approved. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. Well, they must not have been very good parents if they're just easily get rid of me after I told them that literally he was forcing on this girl. But whatever. Probation? Really now? It's the word that applies to you. Your sentence lasts until Oh, being labeled. Oh no, I'm being labeled by society. here for the coming year. Cause any problems and you'll be sent straight to juvie. Okay. We're going to Shujin tomorrow. Sujin? Sujin Academy, the school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place that'll accept someone like you, you know? What a waste of my Sunday. I'm sorry, Sojiro. I know it's football a season. Ago. I brought it up here for you. Thanks. It'll be living here starting today. I should check out what's inside. It's the cardboard box sent from back home. It's full of clothes and daily necessities and DLC items, bid bobs and clothing and costumes and whatnot. Alright. I guess I should clean the room while I'm organizing things. Uh, what can I clean here? Oh, the shelf of books. Some parts of these shelves have rust on them. All these difficult looking books were carelessly crammed in here. Alright, so can I like clean? There's all this unused household items laying around here. It's not organized at all. I should start cleaning. Let's do it. Yeah, pretty much what I would do. Just start cleaning up, organizing some shit. Surprised he actually gave me some Mr. Clean in a bucket. At least there's that. Well, those all coffee beans? Yeah, product of Columbia. He just keeps his random coffee beans up in the attic. Make my bed as you do. It's late. It seems like I've been cleaning for a while. Hey, Sojo. What the heck? I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Well, yeah, man, I want to live up here. I found some lights, I guess. It looks Actually, a lot better. The place doesn't look too bad. Yeah, well, it's thank only you. natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? I'm going to close up shop and get Dinner? out of here myself. Food? <laughs> I won't be the one looking out I get you no if you food. get sick from staying up too late. You got that? You got it. How to advance time. You go to bed to advance the time. That's it. <laughs> it says also think carefully because, you know, you can only do a certain amount of things daily. And then once you go to the next day, you know, then you have to figure out what to do with that during the day. Don't worry. I got you covered. We're going to be doing a lot of stuff on each day when it comes up as it presents to us. So we're going to get super OP at the end of the game to whoop some ass and take some names. And I hope you join me for that in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please hit like, hit subscribe, do all those things on down below. If you're excited to start this new playthrough of Persona 5 Royal back in action here on the Nintendo Switch. But until next time, I have been Adam, this has been HMO4 Gaming, and this has been Persona 5 Royal here on the Switch, also available on all modern consoles as well. Thank you very much. Have yourselves a great day.